guys welcome back to my channel and today it is another cook with me on Sunday is today Sunday yeah so what we're doing today today we are going to make some simple chicken fajitas I've already cut the the, pe the pepper the bell peppers so we have orange red onion yellow and green bell peppers here and then we have the chicken i'm going to put all of this in the oven which is going to be the simplest way to do it today but that's going to be it and then we are we are also going to be making some banana pudding um for dessert after this and that's just in case you have chicken left over you can make like a tostada and stuff like that and i'll show you how to make a tostada as well if um in here so this is just chicken you could do it two different ways I have seasoned the chicken with garlic pepper and lemon pepper and then we have some olive oil that we're gonna drizzle on top of the the peppers that way they cook while they're in the oven and then I'll go ahead and season the peppers as well so you just have to put some oil on the peppers and a little bit on the pan that way the chicken doesn't stick so we're gonna go ahead and put the chicken in here. And then some of it didn't fit, so I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this over here on the on the stove top. So I'm, I'm cooked. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this in the oven. Oh wait, I need to put some salt in this thing. Okay. Okay, there we and make the banana pudding so I have here whipped cream cream cheese the banana cream pudding some wafers and bananas and some whipped cream Jackie's been eating so is it good Jackie? so we're gonna go ahead and put all of the whipped cream okay so now that we have the cool whip in here we're gonna go ahead and add the cream cheese in there as well we should just add half of it okay. we'll add half a cream cheese in there and then i'll go ahead and make the pudding in here i have three cups of milk and we added some vanilla open it here let's see this is Okay, so now that this is mixed up, I'm going to go ahead and put it in the fridge and let it cool for a little bit. Thick, thick, thicken. Yeah, it's like when I've taken it out of the pan they are all nice and soft i'm going to go ahead and shred the chicken with two forks or just like cut it um and then i'll show you what it looks like once i put it in here all right guys so like i showed you guys this is what the fajitas look like basically i just put them in here and i cut them up and you got yourself some fajitas so it's really simple and easy and while you're either getting ready or you know whatever you have to take a shower get the kids ready or you're just studying and you just pop this in the oven and when it's done you just have to cut it and put it all together in a bowl it's the simplest easiest way if you don't have a lot of time and it tastes fucking delicious put some limon aguacate on top of it and that's it and then a tostada so basically the way i make a tostada is you just put some mayonnaise on it so some mayonesa some mayonnaise just kind of roll that a little bit and then on this one you could i on the fajitas you could use like this one the i found this one and it's cacique cilantro lime sour cream so that's really good too and then this one i use this cheese for the tostadas so once i put that i'm going to go ahead and put some frijolitos so go ahead and spread them out on here 
some smashed up beans and these I smashed up earlier today when I was getting ready to do all of this I just cooked them my sister-in-law has them already cooked in the fridge so I just have to smash them and refry them basically and then un poquito de tomate I'm gonna go ahead and put some chicken I left some chicken out from what I had there un poquito de, de aquí de pollo and then a little, I just have a tiny bit of lechuga because I'm the only one that's gonna, well, if my brother wants some more, my little niece, give her some right now. Y luego el queso. I'm gonna put some cheese on here. So just like that. Mommy. 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 Come on. Why are you making? Some food. Uh, what are you doing? It has beans. You can't eat it because it has beans. Oh, yeah. I'll make you one ahorita que no tenga frijoles. Okay. And then that's it. Just put some little lemon in there and let's see if I can spit it. Oh, no. Not that yet. Not that yet. Mmm. Mmm. so good. So I hope you enjoyed um, the way I made this. Honestly, it's very nice and simple if you are in college or you're in a very busy mom who needs to have dinner on the table. It's kind of one of the easiest and fastest, most delicious way to do it, honestly. Because, like I said, you're just to chop everything. Everywhere. You could chop everything up the night before or just have it chopped yeah. up. Or just have it chopped up and... So you could um, have everything chopped up the night before or chop it up, like I said, and just put it all the way and put it in there and just put it in the oven. It takes about maybe 30, or I don't know how long I left it in there, honestly, but I, you could tell the chicken was already done. Pulled it out, you saw how it looked, and I just cut the chicken and put it all together in a bowl. So that's um, easy, and then the other thing is, <coughs> You can like meal prep this, it's yeah. easier. It's it's really good. I've meal prepped it before and I, that's what I eat usually during the week sometimes. And then the tostada, it's another fun, easy, um, quick little dinner, I guess you could say. They're very simple to make. And the, uh -huh. I mean, you don't need that much to make them and they're freaking delicious. Uh -huh. So um, uh -huh. that's it. And the banana pudding, that's another quick little dessert. You know, it could stay in the fridge. For one to two, one or two days, I don't know. Honestly, I usually when I make it, when I have made it in the past, it doesn't last longer than a day. But like I said, hopefully you did like the video and you enjoyed me cooking with me today, and you learned something or you know I give you an idea of what to cook next for weekend or just in general. Also. Don't forget to subscribe and click the little like button if you like the video and if you want to see more videos like this. I mean, like I said, um, 
they're just simple videos that I, I like I said I like I do enjoy like uh -huh. I do enjoy cooking uh -huh. and just like baking and stuff like that so it's just a quick little nice video and yeah. that I just record myself and share it with you guys the easiest ways that I could yeah. easiest ways that I come up with and think about things you know I sometimes get a little bit busy myself so it's easy for me to do that um click the little bell as well and like I said yeah don't forget to subscribe click the little bell and notify you when I upload videos and if you like the video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video thanks and bye say bye Don't put it back in there. Here. Oh, you do it. Here. You eat the chicken, I'll eat this. Okay, so this is the banana pudding. Hey. It looked kind of funny, but oh well. Let's taste this. What do you think? A number 10? A number 10. Yeah, you better say that. This needs to be the first one. It's melting. What the heck?